What's up guys, welcome back. Today we are gonna talk about the dark matter battery, the big controversial battery, if it's really 150C or not, or the fact that everyone has started their car off of a four or three S LiPo. I know that people have started their cars off of a LiPo before. I said that in my video about how no one's ever done it before, but I was actually being sarcastic because I know people have done it. But the biggest thing to note is that the main battery was completely disconnected and we started it 10 times. 10 times. 10 times. 10 times. 10 times. Today we put together a whiteboard. We can do some simple math and figure out exactly how many amps was pulling from this battery while we were starting the truck. Schizo and I were looking for a creative way to test our new battery. So we decided why not try and start the Schizo truck with it. Not only did it work, but it worked 10 times. However, it was frustrating because people on the internet cried foul, saying C ratings on batteries were lies. We already shot the video and didn't know how to calculate how much power the starter drew after the video was already shot. But we then realized since we had the video and we also knew how much power was used from the battery, we could use this information to calculate the amp draw during our test. We analyzed the video at the audio waveform level and cut the video to the parts where only the starter was running. We combined them all together and watched the video Using Premiere, we were able to calculate the time it took, which was 8.01 seconds of use on the battery to start the car. So then using a simple mathematical proportion calculation, we put 0.774 amps per hour over 8.01 seconds and set that equal to X over 3600 seconds, which is how many seconds there are in an hour. Doing the math, it appears, on average, we should have been drawing 347.87 amps per hour while the car was being started. Remember, we're using a 1300 milliamp hour battery, rated at 150 C and 390 amps burst, so quite possibly, the C ratings are more reliable than some people believe. 